with Off Leash Canine Training in Central Florida. We have 14 month old Adelie here. She is a petite Basset Griffon Vendine. Okay, so she's coming to do our infamous two week board and train um, because she's having issues with, um, <clears throat> she wants to keep her nose on the ground when she's walking. She wants to pull on the leash and she has already barked a few times, um, you know, at various things while she's been here. Um, so check back with us in two weeks, see how she does, thanks. Let's show everybody what you're made of. Nose is to the ground, unresponsive. She looked at me just for a moment. She's pulling. If you could see, she's already got so much strength going just to the end of that leash. So we're gonna see if she knows anything else. Adelaide, place. <gasps> Come on. Yes, good girl, sit. Can you sit? Good. Break, 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 break. Yes, good girl. All right, Adelaide. On, she has decided she is not going to come on up. Come on, girl. Yes, good girl. Adelaide, sit. Good. Down. Down. Break, break, break. Yes, yes, yes. Good girl.
Lucinda Steele and this Bill is my Rim. husband Bill Rim. And this is Adelie. She is our petite facet Griffon Dendine. She's just 14 months old and she is the happiest girl. The breed is actually called the Happy Dogs. She's been a great pup um, and has learned some basic things, but we were having some challenges. Constantly pulling on the lead and um, taking off, given an opportunity, um, over excited with people and other animals. And we really needed a solution after trying some different trainings at home. We researched um, off-leash canine and we worked with Sarah now for the last two weeks at her board and train program. We are thrilled. Addie has responded very well to Sarah, very well to the training, and we've been kept in the loop and had a constant sense of connection while Addie was in training. What else would you say? I would just say that Sarah runs a very nice program because she loves dogs. She makes sure that all the dogs are happy and taken care of. And just by virtue of the fact that we get a morning wait on her every day, we got a lot of communications. Um, it was a pleasure working with girl. somebody that's so professional and so communicative and so much with dogs and her family was able to share our dog with them the kids were there which is great for she, Addie. she had a very homey type existence for the two weeks that she was there and it made us feel really good inside Addie to know that our girl. dog was with her down good girl. Um, Communications again are just huge and, and everything to us in terms of uh, making sure that uh, the daddy was well taken care of and we didn't have to worry anything at all about her when she was with Sarah. What you don't see on this video right now. I was going to show it. Three ducks <laughs> over that Addie is um, watching and very interested in. Addie's breed was bred for rabbit hunting. So this is all her nature. <laughs> it's a go, go, go. Yep, they're not holding the leash or anything, huh? Addie, She's definitely down, a down. Good girl. <laughs> so this type of progress is just amazing. And we're <laughs>